when Eric and I woke up, we found a note um, from Kevin uh, saying that he was going to go back to the house. Uh, so we're on our way back uh, to the house to see if we can find him. Holy shit. Attic. This is Kevin's camera. Okay, yeah, come man. in. It's good nice to meet you, man. Meet you, man. Yeah. Polly, Gabe's here. I uh, definitely feel like there's something here. Like I said, give me a couple days. I can get back here. Do not talk to it. Do not address it. Polly? Polly? Polly! Oh. The power's out. I don't have a lot of battery left. Doesn't appear to be anybody here right now, but they're supposed to be here, so. Hi, we're here. Wow. Yeah, this is their room. What's this thing? Uh, just, I think it's the bathroom. Hi, Mason. Hello. Mason. This is a wreck. Did you hear that? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, this is their room. What's this thing? Uh, just, I think it's the bathroom. Hello? Mason. <gasps> Holy hell. Are you guys okay? I think through the fan out here. Okay. Mason, Holly, this is uh, Loretta Stone. She's a specialist I've brought to help because uh, I really feel like this is the most advanced case I've ever dealt with and I really need some assistance on it. Um, I feel like she's a good part of the team that's going to help dial in and, and solve this problem. Um, I just I feel strong about her helping out. I know she's got a lot of connections. It's really nice to meet you guys. Um, I'm Loretta and uh, I'm definitely here to help you guys and help you through this. You know, um, you're not alone. Um, people go through this. I, I, I haven't really seen anything on this level before. I mean, this is pretty, pretty intense. But there is hope, and there is there is definitely help for you. I can. You know, I'm gonna stick around and show you guys you know, some things that you can do to kind of keep it. Not at this intensity. If y'all don't mind while y'all are talking, um, got a lot of stuff I gotta get out of the van. And yeah, feel free. I mean, do your thing. Yeah. And just the sooner I get it in, the better. Uh, y'all just continue to talk. Sure. Thank you. All right. So I don't know if he told you what it is that I do exactly. I just, um, I just kind of sense and feel things. There is, there's quite a few. Quite a few entities just just present here. What I'm really starting to feel is there's there's one presence in particular that is it's really dominant, really really dominant, and it's focused on you. It really really does not like you, and I don't want you to freak out or worry about this too much because you know, I'm going to be here to help you through this. I want to show you a few things so you can be protected from this dominant presence that's in your home. Thank you. Does the name Kevin mean anything to you guys? 
It does. Um, the first investigator that we had here, uh, his name was Kevin, and uh, he went missing. 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 And we don't know what happened to him. He left a videotape behind. Um, and I'll let you see. I'll let you see that tape. Um, he's not. Mis- he's here. What? Like I feel him. Like. Like I feel him very strongly. He's here. What do you mean he's here? He's not here. I, I don't know. I. I yeah, he, his pre- he's present. He's present here. I'm feeling this so strong. Like, so you guys, is, he's is he here in the dead? house? You haven't seen no, him? No, he hasn't. Been, we haven't seen him since the night he went missing. It was. Um, is he dead or is he alive? I mean, what 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 do you mean you? He's well, here. Before we before we get too panicked and stuff, I I think what I want to do is I want to I want to have to definitely take some time spend some time in each of the rooms and uh, get a real sense because you know these things come at me and I, I'm not quite sure exactly what it is that I'm picking up but I'm definitely right. picking up Kevin is it, it just it's just loud Kevin was um, the first investigator that we had out here and it was um, it was pretty scary and we haven't heard from Kevin since, so you say Kevin, and that scares me a little. It was that traumatic. Well, I have to say the the feeling associated with his name is very intense. Like there's a lot of energy flowing with just that name, so I'd like to definitely investigate that a little more. As soon as the power comes back on. Um, we got a lot of footage to show you that you need to see. Oh, fantastic. That would, that would be great. Yeah, Mason, I brought battery backups for the computers, so we can probably get that going in a little bit. And, uh, awesome. So we can keep everything going. Fantastic. Awesome. But, Thank you. Would you guys mind if I walk around and, and do a, a blessing of the house? Yes. I, just, I just really feel like we need to get that underway real quick. Absolutely. Thank you guys for coming out. Oh, I am so glad to be here. Holly, you want some water? So what I'm going to do is I'm about to bless your house. And um, before I start, I forgot to ask you guys. Are you guys spiritual in any kind of way? Well, I mean, I've been to church a couple times. Okay, I need you to listen to me very closely. Whenever you're following me, you're going to have to follow me with conviction. You're going to have to follow me fearlessly. If you do not follow me without fear, and if you do not have conviction in what it is that I'm about to do, this is not going to work. Okay. Can you do that? I think so. All right. I'll do my best. You understand, Holly, no matter what, I don't care if the house is acting crazy or whatever you see, you stay there. Do not move. Do you understand? And do your best. I know this is scary, but I need you to be as fearless as you possibly can. All right. Let's do it. Okay. Okay. All right. I'm following you.
blessing this house, I invite a shield of protection to the entire house. Are you ready? Ready. I bless this house in the name of the Holy Spirit and through God our Father Almighty. I ask that you bring peace. I ask that you bring love. And I ask that you bring wholeness into this house, Father God. Are you okay? Yeah. All that is evil, be gone from this house. I ask that you bring light. And I ask that you bring strength into this house, Father God. And I ask that you bring protection into this home. Father God, just bless this home in your most holy name. We pray. Amen. Okay. Amen. That's okay. That's okay. Just want to make sure that they're all right. I'll be back around. Okay. What'd you do with the flashlight? Shit. Where did he put it? step on this staircase it's just dreadfully heavy just crushing and makes me a little nervous just... this room now got it right there that's your source There's so much so much energy flowing from that and it's not good energy that's for sure definitely heavy that's about the best way I can describe it I don't know I just keep getting pulled to this room too 